Hey girl, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If it is your first time here, I am Ursula, your CEO of The Boutique, and welcome to another vlog. Yeah, I did. <laughs> Today is Sunday, September 4th, and before we go any further, stop the video, subscribe to the channel, make sure you like this video, leave a comment because y'all, it really matters in the YouTube world. And we have to give a special happy birthday to my girl, Queen B. Today is September 4th. <laughs> Today is September 4th. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Okay. Y'all, I am getting all dolled up. It is time to take the pictures for the um, website. This is the Ease Into Fall Anniversary Collection. We make one year old, I have told you, one year old on Tuesday, September 6th. And so I'm about to do my hair and um, get ready. I really wanted some pictures outside. I really wanted this anniversary collection to be different than any other photo shoot that I've had and any other collection that I've dropped because I mean, one year old anniversary, that's special. Y'all know whenever you have an anniversary for anything, that is special. So I wanted it to be different. The weather is, you know, I mean, I can't complain. That's God's work, but it's not what I need to give the finished product of what I need, but we will still make it work. Oh, and look, okay. This one is, it's a little dirty, but these are the nails that I showed y'all. These are the nails. These are my press-ons that I did. Polished, filed, did all that. So anyway, let me finish getting ready and I will try my hardest to bring you all along. Y'all, I am back. I am in the car. We're headed to the location. Okay, y'all, I did not know what lippy to put on. I really didn't want to do a nude lip. I really wanted to do either pink or color. But I just thought it would play it safe and keep it with the nude. My photographer today is Coco. Kaylin is going to be my videographer. She's going to get uh, footage for me to make reels as well as for the vlog. Well, I actually brought my tripod and my other phone so that I could get footage for the vlog. So let's go. All right, y'all. This is the part I hadn't done in a long time. Now I have to change and I'm changing in a car. Whoo, y'all, I'm trying to beat the weather. I'm trying to get all the jumpsuits done first because I am wearing my body shaper. I mean, hey, it is what it is. I don't get dressed, y'all. I don't wear anything at any time, especially when I'm going somewhere. I will not wear it without a body shaper. So I'm trying to get all the jumpsuits done. And I'm gonna do this one next. I know it's gonna be hot because it's long sleeve and it's 82 degrees outside. So let me change. I'm just trying to keep y'all updated. Kaylin just got here. She had to go back home to grab some earrings that I forgot. So um, we're just working as fast as possible, trying to beat the weather. So let me go. Y'all, that was a whole workout. And I still don't have it all the way on. I have it on enough, but now I got to get out the car and finish fixing it. Oh, y'all. The things we do to catch the shot. Y'all would not believe this. Y'all see this? And this nail came off right when I was trying to get the comb. Now I have to try and hurry up and put this nail back on. This is not for me. I need to be at home or in a studio taking pictures because this right here, this is not for me. This is a lot. And I need to take this gum out of my mouth. I apologize, y'all. I know that is so rude. Now I understand why people always saying something about no gum, no chewing gum. It's too much. I just need these nails to hang on till I'm done with this. After that, they can pop off. They can do whatever. I don't care. I just need them for this photo shoot. That's it. Putting it back on. I've always wanted white nails, y'all. It don't even feel secure. Oh, let me get this gum out of my mouth. Oh, Lord. Let me get out of here. Do you slide on all your The quality might not be the same, but I just got to tell y'all this. I just did all the pictures in the green tie-dye jumpsuit. 
with a black bangle on. I wasn't supposed to have that bangle on and it's too late. I don't know if I'll be able to Photoshop it out of the picture. I am just, y'all, I'm over this already. I'm over it. I can't do this again. I got to rent out a, a studio or something because this, I can't do it. I can't do it. And I'm real anal about my pictures, but I can't do it. <laughs> this is the walk. She's waddling, guys. Because my nose is leaking and I really need to, um... <laughs> my nose is leaking. Got that on camera, by the way. Your TV's leaking again. Oh, Got another one. Now I gotta put the the last jump. I'm putting on the last jumpsuit and the kimono, and then I'm moving to the dresses. I have three dresses, so y'all. I know I just said this, but y'all, this is a lot. It is a lot. My hat goes off to all the ladies, all the bloggers that just do this on the daily. Like this is a lot, and I know I'm not used to it. This is the first time in a long time. Actually, I've never done this for the boutique before. So my hat goes off to you bloggers, to you fashion bloggers that do this on the daily. Kudos to you. Y'all see that? I just put these nails on yesterday. I don't know if it's the nails, if it's the polish. I don't know what it is, but baby, this thing just split. But lit, y'all, look at this. Split. I don't care, I'm not going back to the nail shop at any time soon. No, I'm not. It's all an agenda. How do you feel? Spectacular. <laughs> this the last dress? No, I have one more. I'm riding with no Y'all, oh my gosh, I have one more look. I am getting extra hot my hair is starting to sweat i feel like my face is starting to sweat can y'all tell oh my goodness i'm trying to hurry up i have one more look let me get dressed <laughs> Be ready. Wait. The Why confetti you... is in there. Don't it's... pull it. You got to pull that off. Wait, wait, wait. Mama. What you got to pull off? It looks like it's you got to pull that thing. off. It ain't no black thing. You probably got to pull this. It looks like. Everybody just wait. Where, wait. where are the instructions? Oh, you got to twist the bottom. Oh, and it's going to shoot at the top. Pull, pull the fall, fall off. Take it off, mama. Hold this. Here, come on. All right, let's go. One, two. Scary. Three. Ready? Woo! Yes! Happy, happy one year anniversary Woo! to the boutique! All right, y'all. We have wrapped. Bro, it's bright outside. Yeah, I see. We have wrapped the boutique by Ursula anniversary collection photo shoot. This was my video person. <laughs> And this was my photographer right here. And y'all, these cars are coming. They are coming. All right, y'all. I don't know the word. I don't have on. I had to stop 
I forgot the shorts to put up under this particular dress. When I um, did my TikToks, I used some little short shorts because this dress is short. It is perfect for um, when you want to get dolled up and just make a statement, honey. The Candy Girl Baby Doll dress will do that. However, Coco with the confetti, I was trying to get a banner picture for the website that says happy one year anniversary with the confetti popping. But Coco didn't quite understand the assignment, although I really appreciate you, Coco. Everything that you have done, she didn't get the look or the picture. She did not get the picture that I wanted. But I'm going to make it work with what she got. Thank you, Coco. Thank you, Kaylin, for y'all working with me for my anniversary collection. Now, I'm going to call y'all back. Good morning and welcome back to another vlog. Today is Tuesday, September 6th, and y'all, it is my one year anniversary. Woo! Woo! Happy one year anniversary Woo! to me, Woo! I am so excited. I'm nervous. My collection is about to drop in what? Four minutes, it is 8.56 a.m. And my collection is dropping and landing on the website at 9 o'clock a.m. Central Standard Time. And y'all, oh my God, every time I have a new collection to drop, y'all, I feel like I'm just launching for the first time all over again. I mean, I cannot explain it. So much hard work go into what I do. And again, y'all, I am a one woman. Well, let me stop saying that because... I mean, I do everything and eventually God will bless me to be able to outsource some things, but I'm not the only person on my team because my daughters, they will do whatever I need them to do. My husband, my children, everybody, the entire family, but I'm the one that just in the end, I handle everything. You know, I am the glue, okay, to the boutique by Ursula, but anyway, I just wanted to come on and let y'all know that I am celebrating my one year anniversary of being in business with the boutique by Ursula. I pray for many more. I speak more knowledge over this business. I speak longevity over the business, consistent sales. Baby, let me just stop all of that. I pray these things daily over my business. But I just had to come on to share this moment with you all because I am about to drop. Woo! Okay, it's 8.58. I think I'm going to go ahead and start putting everything on now. I really want to revamp this website. I just didn't have the time, the not, you know, because I do, every, I do it all myself. So I really need to um, go to YouTube University for a little bit. But that's up next. So let me go. Hey y'all, I'm back. It is now, it is now one o'clock in the afternoon. Still the same day that I dropped the collection. I just wanted to come on and just kind of share how I'm feeling right now. <sighs> I have so many mixed emotions. You know, prior to a drop, you have to build up the suspense. You have to um, pretty much advertise what you're going to have coming out and let everybody know so that the day that you drop it, you make sales. Well, I had so many people hitting me up, wanting this, wanting that. And before I go any further, y'all, I am blessed. I am grateful. I thank you, Lord, for the customers that I have, for the sales that I make. I am. All I'm doing is expressing to you all what happens and how people, some people, some people will have you thinking that they just want this, that you think that you are about to just make all these sales and it's just not happening like that. My kimono video, well, it's not my kimono video, my video about my hair, but really it was about the kimono because I was showing and advertising the kimono and y'all that video on TikTok is at like 75k views. So many people wanted to know about the kimono and all that. So I thought, Lord, these kimonos are about to fly off the website. No, I have not sold not one kimono. Now, I know that will change, but I'm just telling you all that I had so many people. They were interested in the jumpsuit, the olive green tie-dye jumpsuit, the, um, the dresses, like just so many different pieces. But I think so far I've had... I think I've had six sales so far. Again, 
I am grateful. I'm thankful because a one beat a zero. Like I expressed to y'all in the last video, my spring collection did so well. I made so many sales in just like 30 minutes and then in an hour and then two hours. Like y'all, it was just so, ooh, I am trying to get that again. Actually, I'm trying to surpass that. When I have a drop, I always set a goal for myself. So when I don't hit that goal, it just hurts. It's, you know, I mean, if you're not a business owner, if you've never done what I'm doing or had your own business, I don't think you'll quite understand the way I feel. After watching Power, I'm doing the same thing that they do, except they slinging dope and I'm slinging clothes, but it's the same concept. It's the same. It is truly a hustle, but I just made one year today. And it's still, oh, I know you can't start at the finish line, but y'all, it just hurts my feelings when I don't meet my goal and when things don't go how I expect them to go. But the day is not over and I'm not just throwing in the towel. I'm just pretty much, I just wanted to express how I was feeling right now. I want y'all to experience the many ups and downs that I experience with this business. So that's it. Thank y'all for listening to my rant, but I'm going to stop now. If I remember, I'm going to try and come on at the end of the day to let y'all know where I am with sales and how everything is going. Okay. I'll call y'all back. Hey y'all, today is Wednesday and it is the day after my lunch. I forgot to come back on last night. As y'all know, I stated how I was feeling. Well, last night I was very frustrated and I did it to myself. Oh, I didn't even bother to come back on, but I did get three more orders. So that made a total of nine yesterday, which is a blessing. Again, don't get it wrong. It's a blessing. It's just when I don't make my goal and what I have in mind, that's the problem. But anyway, y'all, I was at Smoothie King and I just left the track. And y'all, the hair, y'all know I had the long hair on the side. I was so frustrated because that hair was just, it had gotten so tight. And I'm just not used to the hair anymore. You know, I was natural for eight years. I've only been back to a relaxer for five months, uh, six months. So y'all look at this. Can y'all see that? Y'all see that right there? I was in the drive-thru at Smoothie King and... The hair was so wet because I had the hat on from sweating at the track that I just start pulling them out. And I had my hat off my head, y'all, just like this. Y'all see this? Had my hat off, talking to the people in the window at Smoothie King as if I had my hat on. Didn't realize my hat was off. I was looking crazy. That's why that girl was smiling. I'm about to go in Walmart, get some supplies so that I could fill the orders. Y'all orders are on the way.